In this video, I'm going to talk about the substitution effect, something common in microeconomics. Here I have total income is $12, price of A is $1.50, price of B is $1.50. If I put in the budget line, it looks something like that. The budget line is in red, the indifference curves are in blue. Now I'm going to talk about what happens if the price of B falls to a buck, and we'll be able to derive the demand curve. So the consumer will consume at this level with the indifference curve and the budget line touch, or 5 of A and 3 of B. That 3 is there, that quantity B and that quantity B are the same. By the way, that buck 50, that dollar 50, and that dollar 50 are the same too. Now if we slide that little purple dot down, the consumer will consume at a price of $1.50 and three units. So if the price of B falls to a dollar, we see the budget curve rotate out like that, and the consumer now consumes at a new point. At this point, they'll consume four units of A and six units of B. Like before, the six comes down, then that little dot comes right down there, so they'll consume at that level. That dollar is the same as that dollar, and voila, that's your demand curve right there, using the substitution effect. 